having a propensity to toss out a flash kick here or there. Just keep you honest. Let you know what's up. Yeah. I have one of these moves. It's four frames. It's pretty good. So according to Twitter, there was 140 pools. So there is, this is a 280-man bracket. Insanity. In quarters. We were, we were close. Our, yeah. Between two mm -hmm. There we go. Oh, wow. He made it all the way under there. He crossed himself up there. I don't think yep. he expected to go that far. Again, Luffy, last year's champion, he's the man to be. I don't care what anybody says, he's the one who a champion on his name right now. He is the man to beat. He is the one everyone's gunning for right now. Dominion trying to get his opportunity here in the quarterfinals bracket. And he's looking very strong right now. He's got Luffy into the corner. Two throws in a row. Again. Look at this pressure from Dominion. He is not letting up. Great distancing to catch that slide. Nice throw tech, but this is a bad situation for Luffy. He's got to do so much da damage in Dominion. No Sonic Boom. Yeah, got to stop throwing those Sonic Booms because you're just giving her meter. Okay, that's what he wanted off of it. He gave her a little bit of meter to make sure that he sealed the round. It's important to space them perfectly, and he got that one. Dominion, first round. He's got enough of a life lead that he's going to be comfortable playing this fireball game for a while. And let's not forget Guile, of course, recovers very quickly after his front of as well. It's not going to be quite like other characters playing the fireball game. Oh, did he get this out in time? I mean, no, yeah. Good block, good block. Still has one orb left. Oh, he could have comboed off of that. I just don't think he was ready. Was not. Okay, a full meter now for Luffy. Very dangerous. Any hit in the Soul Spiral is going to be very easily hit confirmed into a super. Very oh. comfortable pressing buttons, but now things are going back his way. Oh, wanted to save himself just to make sure. And spends all of his meter just like that. Smart. Wait till he sees that whip button to activate the orbs. Trying to get in there. Dominion says, you know what? I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of dodge. I don't think he minds. Good throw tech. Oh! And then the... Oh, but no flash kick. He wasn't confident that he had it charged up just yet. Oh, he went for it. He went for it. That was a hard lead from Luffy. But great patience from Dominion to wait it out. No wake up flash kicks from Dominion. Luffy knew that was gonna chip, so he said, you know what, I gotta beat you with my more invincible move. And so Dominion says, you know what, I read you on that one, and so I'm just gonna chill here. Uh, he got away with some, um, I believe, anti airable jumps, but, you know, Dominion's just trying to play better safe than sorry, right, and, and he exactly. blocked us. Look this round, though, if he's, if he's on his game for the jump back Ooh. buttons or jump back air grab, something like that. Burge does have a very lofty jump. That means it will be able to react to it. Nice. Oh! That's Ooh. damage. He'll go for it Ooh. again and oh, again. again. And a stun! Ooh. Guy and then Minion. a boot to the face. Dominion trying to send last year's champion nice. to the loser's bracket. Last year's second place is there. They're waiting for him already. That's true. And again, this is not a matchup that a lot of people consider it favorable for Guile, but Dominion playing it so well. And you know what? He has a lot of experience in this match fighting against Arturo Sanchez. And, and we see like what Guile can do in this Sonic Boom game. Because he recovers so quickly, he's able to jump in behind it, so she can't just be comfortable uh, absorbing them as right. much. Oh, wow. Spacing from Dominion. Didn't mind it last time. Let's see how it goes this time. There you go, clean anti-air. Dominion, upside down, EX flash into the kick. EX. And then the backwards hop kick. Fade away so bad for the win. And first and second place have, from last year have been sent to loser's bracket. However, third place, huh? Fudo still moving forward. He is in winner's bracket still. Hey, last year was last year. This is this year. Oh, yes, for you know sure. What I mean, and that's how these guys are approaching this tournament. You might have done very well last year, but all I have to do yep. is beat you two games. Now, here is an unexpected match. A lot of people aren't going to know the player that Tokido is going up against. Okay. But he is an old school player. He was a very big CVS2 fan and one of the best S Groove players that there was. And? It's his birthday. It's his birthday Happy today. Happy birthday. Well, the murder face will have no sympathies for birthday. But let me tell you something about it Dr. It might be his death day as well. <laughs> exactly. 
But let me tell you something about Dr. B here. Uh -huh. In CVS2. He's an actual doctor? No? No, not okay. an actual doctor. Oh, okay. But, you know. Tell me. But, uh. Still cool.